There's no way that Nathan could have known this, but when I was leaving the house this morning, and I pulled out of the driveway, and I get down, I mean, it's not far at all, and a dove flew right in front of my car. And it landed, I mean, because I slowed down, and it landed on the power line. And it just landed there. And I just kind of looked and I thought, and then y'all sang, then we sang, come rest on us. You know, God will speak to you in things like that. So, I mean, you can say whatever you you want to. You, you can say it's circumstance or happenstance. I don't believe things like that. I believe there's a plan and a purpose for my life and my steps are ordered of the Lord. And that every time something happens in my life, if I am watching and listening for Him in it, He'll speak to me in it and through it. And so I just say that today, that the Spirit of God is resting upon us. That it is not just within us, but that is when the disciples of John the Baptist recognized that Jesus was the Lamb of God. Because the Spirit of God rested upon him. That's what that's what John said. That the Lord had said to him, when the Spirit, when you see the Spirit rest upon him and it doesn't come off, you'll know that that's the Lamb of God. That's why he said, behold, the Lamb of God. Because he recognized it. And that we are in a season of shifting today. This is a pivotal day and a pivotal moment to shift into the new. And I'm telling you, you need to, the the, the weightiness of it and the heaviness of it, um, it's a good heavy and a good weight because it's the glory of the Lord. But there is a shift happening. And uh, you know what? Only two of John's disciples recognized that it was Jesus and followed him. So anytime there is a shift that's happening, make sure that you recognize Jesus because he's always passing by. He's always passing by. So Lord, we constrain you today as you're passing by. And we say, come rest on us. Come dine with us today. We've made a place at the head of the table for you today. We're giving you our presence today. And we say, come rest on us. Come sit with us. Come sup and dine with us. That we may partake of you and you partake of us. And we become one. As you and the Father are one. That the world may know that you are who you said you were and who you say you are today. Spirit of God, rest on us.